Something I learned over the years is that our food choices are socially based, not nutritionally based. For example, my desire to eat buffalo wings while watching football has absolutely nothing to do with my body's desire to consume the nutrients from that chicken. It's about nostalgia. It's about habit. It's about continuing something that I associate fond memories with. But because our society, particularly restaurants or barbecues, revolve around cooking meat, it really limited social opportunities. So I was excited on opening night of football season this year to see that the art house had a rather extensive vegan menu. And I was actually able to have buffalo wings and a beer. And my girlfriend got vegan mac and cheese with mushrooms. Even the sauce was vegan and it was good. It wasn't just like eating uh, chicken wings. There weren't bones and you weren't pulling the flesh of an animal that lived its life in misery apart and putting it in your body. But I've already proven physically that I don't need meat. So the only thing really left as a challenge was not being able to go to and participate in some of the things that I used to. And now that is changing. That's good news. There's no good reason to keep eating things that are bad for us, cause misery for the animal, and destroy the planet.